Hello, we're here at the spa. The fixed 20 minute GT3 series. Uh, I believe we qualified around 10. And as you can see, we are in VR for this one. Um, I'm trying to avoid using any sort of HUD or anything, so I don't have my relative or anything open, so I'll really have to make use, so I don't even have the virtual mirror either, so I'll really have to make use of what I got here to try and stay as safe as possible. It's going to be challenging, but it should also be fun. We're going to go in here now. I might not talk so much because I am going to need to focus. Looks like we might have an inside route. Alright, I don't want to go in here side by side, but let's see. Audi's pretty loose here on the first lap. Yeah. Fine, I'll take the track cut, but at least I didn't get a slowdown. I've noticed the Audi's been very difficult to drive on this track. Like, first two laps like it just feels very loose everywhere and it doesn't seem to really get too much better throughout the race but I guess we'll see the fix series a little bit better set up in uh, the open series, they are very aggressive setups, I imagine. You're gonna have to try and fix them to uh, stay a little safer. Yeah, hopefully I'm still in the draft range. I don't think I am uh, after that mistake. I believe I lost the draft, which is very unfortunate. This guy is just going to be able to... I'll just give him the inside. been a while since I've raced in VR too. I did a little bit of practicing to do a 40 minute race in VR, but I'm still very shaky in it. It's very different than having a static screen. But yeah, like I think a lot of people are struggling. Cause like on these high speed corners, like you always see somebody spun out.
a relatively quick race too, probably 10 laps. Yeah, you even gotta do a little lift on that corner. So many times in practice, like I would go flat out and the car would just, almost felt like it would lift off the ground. It was very odd. Also, I have no idea what the strength of field is or anything like that either, so I guess we'll find out at the end of the race. Yeah, this Lamborghini, he's definitely got more pace than me, but, you know, just because of the draft, we're able to stay close. see if he starts catching up to the people in front that'd be nice because I don't think I would have been able to on my own looks like there's a little bit of a further gap behind so should be pretty secure as long as we don't make too many major mistakes or at least stay in this position Well, that's unfortunate. You could tell he's a little hard on the brakes there on the on the turn in. Hope we can catch up to these guys now. Look what kind of lap times I'm doing. Two seventeen would be phenomenal. I don't think I've ever done that on this track. Looks like we might have got it yet. Two seventeen eighty. That's with draft. It's not a, a true solo two seventeen. I wonder what position I'm in. I saw a couple cars up front, way ahead. There's these four. Probably like what, eighth or ninth, maybe? If we call it like tenth, we pass two or three guys. Maybe seventh. That'd be pretty good. battle here. Might have looks it, I think the guy behind is catching. Yeah. I wonder if he got hit or if he just lost it on that corner. It's so interesting like it's just a matter of keeping the car on the track and and you do well. Like I guess that's just at my eye rating. I don't think we're quite in range yet, but we're getting there. Hopefully they kinda of start battling amongst themselves. Give us a chance to get with the draft. So there's one, two, three, four, five people I see ahead. So that would put us in sixth.
Yeah, I don't know if it's just an Audi thing or if it's all the GT3s. But this is like one of my favorite tracks and it's too bad, it just feels super like risky just taking any corner how I used to. And like, like that's probably a new tire model in a GP3s or whatever, like maybe you're not supposed to be able to take a lot of these stuff uh, flat out. Like less source and, or is it even less source? Eau Rouge. Um, I remember when I first started playing this game, you know, having a lot of trouble doing it flat out, but then once you get used to it, it was easy. But maybe it's just a matter of getting used to it with the new tire model. Yeah, right here too, like on that second part of the left-hander. The car just feels like it, it's gonna cock on you. I have struggled in that corner for some reason. Yeah, damn. Gave this guy an opportunity to get it within range behind. And we're losing the guys in front. Can't be making mistakes like that. Don't know if he's quite in draft range yet, but he will be soon. Yeah, oh jeez. I guess I'm losing a lot of time in the uh, game there. behind them. There's a couple cars behind. It's four, pretty close by. We're gonna have to just let them pass here though. There's no reason to defend. If I'm defending, then the guys behind us are gonna catch. Yeah, hopefully he's got more pace than me. He can actually maintain. Oh yeah, he's definitely faster than me. That's the problem is I have no idea how many laps or anything like that that we have left. I'm 
should have probably been counting in my head. I want to say what, four or five? How many cars have we seen do that on this corner? It's three, I think, at least, right? Well, I feel like I have a lot of grip now, though. That was weird. Does it take, like, maybe a few laps to get there? on this one. Right? Yeah, it's weird. I feel like I've got grip now. I wonder if that's going to maintain like this or what. Yeah, pretty much kept it flat out through there. Maybe it just takes more and relax. Where the track cooled down a lot, there's no sun. I really don't know. What the hell's going on? <laughs> it feels like, you know, the spa before now. Maybe I'm just not overheating the tires. Definitely doing something wrong in this corner. So I'm losing most of my time, I think. more position but I think it's just much faster than me everywhere that I won't be able to defend it but we'll see like I don't even think I get close enough after Oh Rouge Oh Rouge he might be in draft range too mm, I don't think he is That's unfortunate. 
kind of turned in way too early. It is what it is. Sixth place, maybe? Take a look at the results after the race. It's gonna be the fastest lap of the race, though. Oh, almost 260. Not bad. Good job. Good job. Parker up here somewhere. Do one last. Let's just pull off to the side here. Hey, well that was that was a good fun race in VR. 20 minutes a little bit more bearable than 40 minutes. Uh, let's take a look at the results here. Oh yeah, so yeah, we started time to finish sixth. All of our passes are from people spinning out three of them from that one corner. Um, but yeah, no, it was a lot of fun. Definitely need to work on pace here. Yeah, we qualified with a 218. Looks like, you know, being able to do a 217 is really important. But yeah, all in all, good fight. I'm really curious as to what the strength, strength of field was. Let's see if I can find it real quick. Um... No, that doesn't show me. Yeah, I mean, I'll probably list it in the description. But anyways, thanks for watching. Have a good one.